Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. How much are the golf clubs? 50 cents. 50 cents? Okay. Guys, welcome back. Today we're going to the flea market, although you might not be able to see it. It's really foggy today. Hopefully the vendors are still out and we can find some cool stuff. Also guys, thank you for the support on the last video with my dad. We uh, wanted, what did you say, 2,000 likes. Which is crazy. Yeah, we thought that was just a huge number. We got it in the first 24 <laughs> hours, so we're definitely filming the video with my dad, but yeah. let's keep things rolling here and see what we can find in the flea market today. I got excited. I thought there were golf clubs over here, but it's just a uh, way to hold these walking sticks. Don't drink and drive. Walk with your favorite beer tap walking stick. That's pretty cool. That's a new one. Never seen that before. Yeah. Did you make them? Yeah. <laughs> They're pretty cool. I just took a fiberglass golf cart, golf club. Yeah. yeah, the shafts. Oh, yeah. it's got the grips and everything. Just took the. <laughs> That's cool. I used to sell these by the sill. Then a guy, old guy gave me the idea. I just, I just stuck it up in there. <laughs> if you want to take it off, it'll come on. Oh, that's cool. Thank you. A little trip over before they pick it Is you know JPX 825 4 iron? What do we got? S300. I think he gets five for the individual ones, right? That's what. Uh, that was last time. Yeah. yeah, we'll see what he's doing this week. Benny. Still five bucks on the single clubs? Yeah. Cool. Yeah, the single clubs are over here, yeah. Yep. The sets are over there. What's that, the burner? Uh, Mizuno JPX. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's a good one too. Yeah. You got five? Cool. Thank you. Thank you. First purchase of the day is this Mizuno JPX 825 foreign. For only $5, we couldn't pass this up, and we managed to lure my dad out of retirement once again. We all like the ball flight on this and that classic Mizuno feel, so definitely off to a good start. Let's see what we find next. Is this thing gas powered or electric? You can go out and uh, give everybody tickets. Maybe the new range keeper? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> out on the course? Yeah. Yeah, you could be the ranger. You guys need to speed up. Traffic no patrol. Mulligans. <laughs> no mulligans. I don't know. Super driver 2. You ever seen one of these, Ash? No. It's like plastic. Yeah, it's a new one. Watch this. I, I guarantee you it's going to be the most expensive club today. I'm going to ask how much it is. How much is the golf club? A dollar. Okay. Dang it, she got me. I thought there was going to be like 20 bucks. <laughs> this is good for a dollar. I've never seen this. Oh it's, oh, it's graphite. It looks like plastic. And then has the, I don't remember what that's called. Yeah, coil, coil hosel. Here you go. Thanks. All right, I think John actually tricked himself into buying this club, the Super Driver Number 2. I'm glad he did, though, because we all hit it pretty well, especially John's dad. I think that's the furthest drive I've ever seen him hit, so it was definitely a dollar well spent. How much is the uh, Toy Story Golf set? Uh, five bucks. Five bucks? Yeah. yeah, I got toys over here that I got a good deal on. I'm just blowing them out. Okay. Got a Toy Story 4 uh, mini golf game. It's like uh, golf and croquet in one. It's pretty cool. Got the nieces and nephews, they have some birthdays coming up. Yeah, I'll give really it to cool. my favorite one. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I feel like balance is restored. Yeah, it can't be a stacked golf video without a flamingo. She actually found one in the last video. I just forgot to put it in there. It was like a Miami Marlins. Uh, uh, it was it? going to Miami. It was like a flamingo on like a floaty tube. Oh, no, it was the Miami Marlins, wasn't it? We'll have to look at the footage. Yeah, <laughs> the lost footage. <laughs> Let me go for a buck. Sold. Okay. <laughs> I got a dollar for you. Thank you. Everybody always uh, gets mad when you give me the money. You spend your allowance. How much is the uh, the poster? Uh, another dollar. Cool. Sold again. Okay. <laughs> Two sales. <laughs> I more coffee now. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You saw the flamingo, but this was uh, in the corner. Ashley spotted it. Mm -hmm. 1980s Pac-Man poster. It's in really good shape. Yeah, it is. This is how, how my parents spent their date nights, apparently. They used to go and play Pac-Man. They would go with, like, I don't know how much money, but uh, a bunch of money at the time worth of uh, quarters or nickels, whatever, how much it costs. Play Pac-Man. They should do that on their phones now. We'll get it for their anniversary, which is coming up.
Oh, they got way more putters this week. Dual Force Rossi, classic. Kenny Perry uh, won a bunch of tournaments with that. Got another Nike Method over here. I like that Method Core, the fat blade one. The one with the uh, wider flange. 45 bucks. Ping Zing 5. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. I've never heard of this shaft before, though. The Pearl by Unifiber and Pearl Golf Company. Hmm. Definitely want the head. I think I have a... I don't know if I have a shaft that will go into this. Probably will. <laughs> yeah, I got a bunch of Adams gloves. What's the best you can do on this guy? <laughs> I don't have a wrench for it. Uh, that's fine. I'll take 24. 20? Okay, cool. I think I have a 20 up. I guess a wrench just had your toolbox fitted. Yeah. Triangle. The what? A triangle wrench is fitted. Yeah, I have, a, I have a few Adams drivers with, I think I have a wrench for it. I'll look for one over there. I could have told it. Say it in the box. I ain't got a wrench. I'm telling you a while. Thank you. Thank you. Next up is this Adam Speedline Fast 12 LS. You guys know that I'm a huge fan of Adams, and this is one of the lowest spinning models that they ever made. It's an absolute rocket launcher. We were all hitting this really well, and these were easily some of the longest drives that I've hit recently, so definitely going in the bag. Super excited about this one. Good morning. Hello. Can we do the dozen sugar? Oops. Powder sugar or cinnamon sugar? Do you want powder or cinnamon? Uh, whichever one's more popular. Okay. Oh, that's cool. They make them right here. Four dollars. Cool. Thank, Thank you. you. Have Enjoy. a good one. All right. We're going to drop off the clubs, but we got some donuts <laughs> for the uh, the walk back. For long haul. Oh wow. Those are fantastic, and they make them right there. It's pretty cool. How much are the golf clubs? Uh, would you sell them individually? Two bucks? Okay. Cool, yep. Thank you. Oh, you're the money man. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Next up is a Cleveland Halo 16 degree hybrid. This one has a stiff shaft, so I wasn't real optimistic about how well I'd hit it, but I hit it surprisingly well. I kind of liked it. Let's see what the kids have going next. Check out this Buzz Lightyear. It's a phone. Oh, it's so cool. And it's got the rocket. Let's see if his helmet opens. No. Maybe needs batteries. Yeah, probably. Oh, some old Big Berthas. Oh, Big Bertha 2 iron. That's pretty sick. Big Bertha 2 iron. That's cool. It'd be funny to compare this to like an expensive driving iron. Yeah. I bet you this thing's comparable. Probably much easier to hit. How much are the golf clubs? 50 cents. 50 cents? Okay. No. All right, thank, thank you. you. Still can't believe we found a Big Bertha 2 iron for only 50 cents. Let us know if you guys want us to compare this to a modern driving iron just to see if you need to go out and spend $200 on a new club or if you can have just as much success with a 30-year-old 2 iron. This was definitely the most forgiving of all the clubs we hit today, which was awesome for me. Got some oldies in here. Okay. Dunlop driving iron, True Tech. I have a driving iron on. Yeah. Not sure if you could hear the vendor, but everything was a dollar. Compared to the big Bertha 2 iron, this was impossible to hit. John seemed to like it though, but what does he know? All right guys, there you have it. Probably our best day of the year at the flea market. Lots of good finds. Excited about that Adams driver. Probably gonna put that straight in the bag. I was just excited I was able to hit anything. So. Yeah, we didn't get the easiest to hit clubs today. A bunch of two irons and driving irons, stiff flex. You find anything good? Uh, I hit a couple of them okay, but they're not for me. You hit the graphite one really good. Yeah, that yeah. was cool. That was pretty cool. <laughs> a little too stiff for me. Uh, all right, guys. So tomorrow is my dad and mom's, what is it, 38th? 
38th anniversary. And I know you guys spent a lot of time at the arcade, so we got you this vintage <laughs> Pac-Man uh, poster. Really That's cool. pretty cool. That's older than me. <laughs> it's older than my older brother, too. <laughs> so, yep. Hopefully you like it. You didn't say anything. Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> you, you were doing all the talking. Uh, yeah, that's my job. You guys just look pretty. I have to do all the talking. All right, guys, there you have it. Hopefully you liked the video. If you did, hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you next time. See, see you next time, guys. Oh, Dad, you ready for the match coming up? I am. Your video, we said 2,000. Ashley did it because she really didn't want to play with you. No, she just said a really high number. I but not. I think it got like 2,700 in the I first. I said 35. 35? Sure. Well, yeah, you, you've been uh, lollygagging. We've yeah. been at the flea market all day. We bet this time to get to like 5,000. No, no, we're not going <laughs> to do that. We're going to do a match pretty soon, so hopefully you guys liked the video. I already did all of that. We'll see you. Get out of here.